Hey guys. Can you hear me? Hi, teacher. Hi, how are you tonight? Hi. Carla, how are you doing? Eduardo? I'm fine, thank you. Great, awesome. All right, it's nice seeing you again. Hey, so everybody finished the midterm. Can you hear me, guys? Yes, teacher. I think I'm having internet problems. I don't know. All right. So, since everybody already finished, supposedly, we're going to check the answers, okay? So, if you have any questions about the exam or something, let me know. I'm going to show you right now. Give me one second. Right, here it is. So section one, we're gonna complete it together, right? So in case you have wrong answers or something, do it with me or take a screenshot. But we'll start off with this. Rechart, what's number one? We're gonna do midterm section A, okay? Uh. Help me out. Richard disappeared. <laughs> One hole, help me out, please. One hole, you're on mute. Okay. Clean up. Clean up. Yeah, but read the whole sentence, please. So please clean okay. up. The Please clean up the bedroom. It's really a mess. All right. Guys, I'm going to mute everyone because it's noisy. I can hear children playing. Hmm, what's that? Okay, I'll mute everyone unless I call your name. All right. Number two, Delia. You're on mute. Don't forget. Can't hear you. Um, uh, could you please put away? Could you please put away? Yes, that should be the one. Put away the, the grocery, grocery. In, the, in the kitchen. Yes, very good. Okay. Now, Rebecca Monterrosa. Can you turn down the TV? Why I'm in the phone. Great, Eduardo. Yes. Okay. Just the exercise microwave. at once. Microwave ovens are using for cooking food very fast. Um, you know, there are two possible answers here because you can also say to cook and it will be all right. Uh, by the way, this is microwave, microwave ovens, okay. Claudia Rivas. Um, when you go to the beach, try not to get the comforter wet. Okay, great. Eric? You can use my cell phone. <clears throat> uh, you can use my cell phone leaving a voicemail. You only have two options here. You can either say to infinity. Or for leaving, uh -huh. for leaving a, a voicemail. Yes, very good. <coughs> but that's not an option, though. Hmm? It's not an option, though. We don't have for leaving. Oh, to leave? Yes, that's the only option. Very good. Okay, number four. Saul. Saul. 
Hello, teacher. Uh, this uh, don't forget uh, for taking your ATM card with you. Don't forget. Oh, you cannot say for taking in this case. Don't forget to take. To take. Yes, because we're not trying to express purpose here, right? So those are the answers, guys. Check them with me so that you can get a hundred, right? I know you already finished, but try to get a hundred percent, okay? I'll help you out. Okay, this was a difficult part for the majority of you. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna show you the answers. Okay, so pay attention, please. Here are the answers. And I just want you to read the answer, okay? So number one, Irania. Just read the answer, that's it. Okay. Somebody. Could you close the door, comma, please? Question mark, okay? Do it with me. This is section B. All right, next one. Um, Lisette, mira. Would you please? Mm -hmm. Go ahead, continue. Yeah. Would you please take out the guys the garbage? Garbage. Question mark. Okay. So these are the possible answers. Would you please take out the garbage or would you please take the garbage out? Right, number three is it. Hey, could you mind on seat here? Yeah, this is the only possible answer though. So would you mind like this? Would you mind not sitting double T there? Okay. Um next. Go ahead and read, please, Anna. Can you please take the cut out? Please take the cat out. All right, great. Check the answers here, guys, in case you don't have them. All right, next one, uh, Irania. To repeat that comment, please. Could you repeat that, please? Okay, could you repeat? Re ah, guys, this is incorrect. This, I mean, it is the answer, but it's incorrect. So this one, could you repeat that, please? Okay, that should be the answer. Hi, Myrin and Benjamin, welcome. Hi, teacher. Hi. <laughs> so say, could you repeat that, please? Okay. So you have the answers, right, everyone? Yes. Yes, now yes. you do? Perfect. Okay, so now I have a question for you guys. Do you want me to continue giving you the answers or are you good? We can study instead. What do you prefer? You need more help? Or can we start in at four? Uh -huh. Eric, what do you think? Eduardo, Delia? You want the answer, guys, or you want to just continue? I know this part was difficult, so I wanted to check give the, the answers. Please check the please. answer, please. You want to check the answers? Delia, Rebecca? For me, continue with number, with unit four. Uh -huh. Okay. Who needs help? That one, I, that one I did already. Okay. Stephanie. Say Richard is, I already did. Mm -hmm. Let me see. The reading is good, right? This is not difficult because it's multiple options, guys. Maybe, I think this is the last part, right? Okay, we're just going to do letter E and finish with that because the reading and listening, they're easy. They're multiple choice. 
Okay, let's do this one and then we're gonna we're gonna start the class. Um, one hole, number one. How do how did the teams respond to the neighbor request? They didn't say anything. They didn't say what what are you reading? Letter E, number one, one before, before and young. Um, which, which section? E. Yes. Mm -hmm. yeah. Let me see. Before a young man and a woman mm -hmm. speak, what's the answer? Ah, Anybody? Yes. Before a young man, uh, they might okay. touch with each other on the internet. All right, let's see. They might chat with each other. Okay, number two, guys, what's the answer? They usually talk. Number two is they usually talk on the phone. Right, three. They often meet in a public place. They often meet in a public place such as, such as a coffee shop. Or they sometimes arrange another date. All right, let's submit this. Let's see. And everything is right. Awesome. And I think that's it. So we can start section four. Do you have questions about the midterm? Anybody? No teacher. All good? Yes. All right, great. Well, let's begin. Get ready. Here we go. Let's see. Um, Carla, can you read the objective, please? In this class, you will be exposed to an audio where example of past, present, and future tense are used. Uh, yeah, this is exposed. Uh, teacher. Yes, tell me. Teacher, I we, we cannot hear you. You're breaking down. Well, you're breaking up. Is that you, Benjamin? I have a I know. question. What's your name? What's your name? Who has a question? Okay. I cannot hear you. Somebody said they had a question, but I cannot hear that person. All right, so I'm gonna move on and you can send me the, the question to my phone. I mean, through WhatsApp or you can send it here to the chat, okay? Because I cannot hear you, you're breaking up. Sorry. All right, let's move on. Get the notebooks out, please. And we're gonna watch this video. So take notes. Okay, we're beginning a new topic, here we go. Hello and welcome back. We're about to listen to different tenses in a single conversation. Pay attention and try to identify the tenses they are using. This neighborhood has changed. Part A. Listen and practice. This neighborhood sure has changed. I know. A few years ago, not many people lived here. But the population is growing so fast these days. Yeah, it seems like there's a construction site on every corner. Remember how we used to buy candy at that little grocery store? Now it's a multiplex cinema. Yeah, and they're tearing down our high school. They're going to build a shopping mall. Soon there will be just malls and parking lots. That's because everyone has a car. Fifty years ago, people walked everywhere. Nowadays, they drive. Listen to the rest of the conversation. What else? Let's not answer the question, but rather focus on. Can you see? 
Can you say well? No. No, teacher. Oh, that's a problem. No, teacher. Okay. Um, that's terrible. Mm -hmm. So, hold on. It has changed a few years ago. Well, I need you to practice the dialogue. I'm going to send it to WhatsApp, okay? I have it here. Give me one second. If I can find it. Hold on. One second. I'm almost there. Okay. All right. I found it. Okay, I have it. So I'm sending it to WhatsApp so that you can see it. And let me open it here. Right there it is. There, I sent it. Let me open it here so you can see. I need you to focus on the structures they're using. Here, give me one second. It's right here. Can you see my screen? Is that better? Yes. 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 All right, awesome. Sure. Yay. It's gonna work then. All right, so what you have to tell me now is where can you see present perfect, past simple, and present simple? Can you find those sentences? It's has everywhere, changed. guys. It has changed. What is that? What kind of tense is it? Past. Mm, no, guys, this is present perfect. Present perfect. Present perfect, but thank you. Okay, what else? What is is growing? What tense is it? Future. The population is growing so fast these days. Present. present. Yes, exactly. It's present continuous. All right. Let's see. What else? What else can you find? When it says there is a construction, like what is that? Here. That's present, sorry. Present. And this? Look, all of these. Past. Pay attention to. Yes, that's past. This is future. future. Right, past. Well, past. Nowadays, they drive present. All right, so I need you to focus on that because you're using a combination of tenses. Anyway, you have questions about the vocabulary? Snow? Fearing. Theater. Where is it? Theory what line? Down. Uh, ah, they're tearing down the high school. That means they're demolishing it. Is okay. that clear? Yeah. Yes, that's what they mean. Okay. Any other questions? Okay, I guess not. Guys, they're so quiet. Okay, let's practice the dialogue, all right? And when you finish the dialogue, you know what we have to do. I would like you to modify it and say, for example, talk about Santa Tecla, for instance, okay? You're going to say, this neighborhood sure has changed. A few years ago, there used to be a something, all right? So let's practice it first and then modify it. Ready? Okay. Okay. So here we go. Accept the invitation, please, and I'll be with you in a second. Yeah. 
Thank you. Excellent. Okay. Excellent. Um, okay. All right, let's practice the dialogue. It's on WhatsApp. This one right here. Okay. All right. Hi, can you hear me, Seth? Yes. All right. Yeah. Awesome. I'm not here at the screen. Great, great, great. Entonces, I you're Tanya not... and I am Matt. Yeah. All right, start. This neighborhood sure has changed. Changed. I know. Excuse me, teacher? Changed. Change. Yes, that's better. Uh, there are too many supermarkets and... Oh, you're changing the conversation already? Great. <laughs> First, practice it without modifying it and then modify it. Okay? <laughs> right, go ahead. No, it is a multiplex cine cinema. Yeah. This neighborhood sure has changed. 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 Yes, that E at the end you don't pronounce. Okay. 